those who try to increase the happiness of the world, their personal happiness will also be increased, said Dr. K. Shuramakar. Nana Pidavadi, Dr. Kota Shuramakaran, born on 10th October 1902 in Udupi in British India or Karnataka, died on 9th December 1997 in Manipur in Karnataka, state of India, was an Indian polymath who was a novelist in Kannada language, playwright and an ecological conservationist. Ramachandra Guha called him the Rabindranath Tagore of modern India who has been one of the finest novelists, activists since independence. He was the third writer to be decorated with the Nyanapit Award for Canada, the highest literary honor conferred in India. Dr. Kesho Ramakaran said, those who try, just to try is enough. You can feel that the energy is bursting with power. Yesterday I was trimming the plants in front of the ashram, trying to make sure that the the, uh, the leg part of the plant is trimmed beautifully so it looks like it is waxed and once it is trimmed or we call it waxed, you can see through what is happening on the foundation level, whether any snakes are hiding, rats are hiding. Once that is trimmed, nobody can hide there. And then we allow uh, the branches to open up towards this, to get more sunlight flowing right inside to create a crown. And we were doing it and I was doing some people stopped and they were telling me, Wow, what a beautiful trimming you are doing. When you do something, you just make a try. And I am not a gardener, a trained gardener. I am just out coming to the ashram. I was just trying to make sure that things look beautiful. And how to allow more sunlight and wind entering inside. And that is the strength of the beauty of the freshness of the new leaves and flowers coming out of the plant and just to try and somebody felt happy. <laughs> they stopped to say, wow, it is beautiful. Same voice, and just to try in the cooking. My kids who came down from Indranagar, they were making a trial and a try in the kitchen. Maybe sometimes pulling it down from the Google to find out the recipe that try and when i tasted i was oh my god what a taste who made it see they tried and happiness is mine you always make an attempt in the conscious level a try is enough that is a small t r y always make an attempt the whole body is powerfully given by nature don't you think so you are a powerhouse, don't you think so? You are a magnet, you just need a little bit of cleaning. You are a powerful mirror which can reflect and just clean the dust. A diamond which is hidden right inside, you have to just sweat it out. And more you sweat, the others are happy, not you. The smell of your sweat in your real hard labor is happiness for others. Yes. That's why they said when Buddha walked inside the forest, the trees which never bore fruit started bearing fruits. Just your presence is enough for the children to be happy that mother is coming. Just to see the mother coming, walking inside the gate, they know something she's bringing, or they can always ask the mom, please make this or that. Just the feeling that father's car is coming or motorbike sound is coming, you know, for the children and the people around to be active.
purely thinks so. Such is the power. So why don't you do it? Why don't we do it? And together we can create happiness. Happiness is the GDP of Bhutan. The Bhutan thinks is not, they count on the money. Money flows of its own. It's just a disciple, a follower. And you keep going and it follows. You turn back to look so much you do not know where to keep it. Such is the power of your try. Those who try to increase the happiness of the world, their personal happiness will also be increased. Just, I bought the mat for my cows. And the cows who were very aggressive became so calmed down, they look at us, they start licking and wagging the tails. Just a little adjustments in the cow shed. The cows comes to know that we are always trying to do something for them. And the milk production increases. The health becomes so powerful. Before when I came down to this ashram, cows were sick, they were bony, they were dying. Just a little bit of discussions, talks, like how I'm talking to you, I go and just talk to them. I don't know whether they understand, but I am very much sure they understand me and I understand them. Because the way they look at me and wag the tail and try to lick me, I can understand there is happiness. And they are also happy because I'm seeing something and they can they can weigh the volume of that sound, whether it is boo or it is the softness makes them very healthy. Hardly any doctors walk inside. Before almost several doctors, veterinary doctors of the cow shit. Yes. My kids when they came from Indranagar to Devanakali, the stress level has come down because they have separate, separate cottages. Washed land, a lot of sunlight falling right into their body and they were sweating. Before they were a little scared, they might, the color might change dark. But uh, first, only the first round, the color changed dark. And later on, the real color of their body, the purity of their color was started coming up and they're feeling very healthy. Keshu Ramakaran said, those who try to increase the happiness of the world, you do not have to increase. He said increase means keep doing your work and sweat. No sweat, no food, no work, no food was the base. Increase the happiness of the world. Yeah, those who try to increase the happiness, of the world, those who work hard and Early birds catches the best to break, creates the best family. And the mother in the house and the father in the house, much before everybody gets up, father has taken the uh, spade, gone to the land. The mother rushes up to the kitchen to make sure the house is clean. They looked at the sunlight, the, lit a lamp and did a prayer called the Surya Namaskar. Happiness, the children get up there is full of happiness. Those who try to increase the happiness of the world, their personal happiness will also be increased. Yes, when, when you keep on doing your work, that is happiness. You can feel the body is paining, but afterwards you can feel anybody comes and asks you, please, can you show me a dance step? Your dance step or your karate or your yoga becomes so beautiful and you get a clap. That is happiness because the pain, what you did then, it just flowed, the action flowed of its own, happiness flowed of its own. The family is rejuvenated with a love, orgasmic love, love experience with the father and mother and children, grandparents. And that connects unknowingly. When I was cutting the plants, people came unknowing, non, not known people. Farmers stopped and said, beautiful. You, that connects to your joint family. Beautiful joint family looks beautiful. It connects and there lies the family tree. Kota Shuramakaran said, those who try to increase the happiness of the world, their personal happiness will also be increased. <laughs>